What is up, everybody? Good afternoon. Welcome back or welcome to Optimal Self Live. Um, the little conversations that, that we uh, put together, little five to eight little minute journey that we get to go on each and every day. Um, really, it's just about it's just about us finding a platform and finding an environment so that we can live the best version of ourselves, so that you have the opportunity to look inside yourself and find a way to be the best version of you. That's what it's all about. So today I want to get into a little bit. Um, there's a word out there that gets thrown around uh, approval. And if you saw it in the title, it says, you know, is approval is external validation. Is that what's killing your vibe? Is that's what's killing you from being your optimal self. And a lot of times it is because our identity and who we are, we're looking for external validation, meaning we're getting we need approval from somebody or we need approval from something. And so many people get attached to the outcome of maybe a goal or maybe a career goal, or maybe it's something that you've wanted in your life. And listen, goals are very important. Don't get me wrong. You need to have targets. You need to shoot for things. But if your identity is attached to the outcome and you don't hit the outcome, your entire identity is shaken, right? You, you start to get attached to, again, an external outcome. And sometimes it's even out of your control. And that's when our lives start to spin out of control is because I'm trying to get into or I'm trying to control something that's uncontrollable. So what do I have to do? What I have to do is start to look inside myself and start to find ways and start to be more tied to my effort, more tied to the things that I can actually control, my mindset, right? The things that I can actually do. What are the things you can control? You can control your mind, your thoughts. You can control your effort. You can control your actions, what you actually do, what you actually do on a daily basis. Think about that. Imagine if your identity, imagine if who you are, I could put in. I put in the best effort that I could put in. What if that's how we judge ourselves? Because what is it? A weight on a scale? Maybe it's the car you drive. Maybe it's the zip code you live in. Who knows? Right? But there are a lot of people right this second struggling that have $150,000, $200,000 cars and, and they can't go a month without revenue in their life. Why? Because they're living to please others. They're living to please the people around them. They're not really for themselves. Because listen, you, you have your goal to be that car, right? Get your Instagram famous and take a picture next to your Lamborghini or your Ferrari. That lasts about 10 seconds, right? Because it's on, it's on to the next. And chances are you probably couldn't even have bought it in the first place. You probably should use that money to go somewhere else. So again, I'll ask you the question, is external validation, is that external validation what's killing you inside? Because you need that, that, that to, be, to make you who you are. And you don't. God, you are such an amazing human. All of you right now are so great, so, so amazing that, that, that the world needs you, that somebody on this earth needs to hear your story. They need you in their life. And not because of the car and not because of how much money you make and not because of the shoes or the belt or the bag you're carrying. It has nothing to do with it. That approval means nothing. Because at the end of the day, you're going to lay down on that bed and none of that shit matters. What matters is, do you approve of you? Do you love you? Is the self-care and the self-love enough for you to be the best version of you. Because that's what this is about. About building a community that we wanna that we want to support one another to be the best version of themselves. Do not let external validation lead your life. Let's challenge ourselves to be the best version of ourselves and let's challenge it day by day based on our effort, based on what we did. Now listen, 
if you laid on the couch all day and watched, you know, been watch Netflix and, you know, and ate out of a cereal box, we might need to reevaluate, right? We might need to look and go, mm, maybe today wasn't such a great day, right? But what, but when you, when you start to eat better and exercise and start to fill your mind with, with the things that are going to lead you to being the best version of you, trust me, you start stacking those days on top of each other and man, watch how beautiful your life gets. Watch how fulfilling your life gets, right? And that's what life is about. It's about fulfillment. Ask yourself, what fulfills you? And let's do more of that. All right. All right. So listen, today is again, don't look for external validation. Look for internal. Look, look inside yourself for that validation because you are enough. You're pretty enough. You're fun enough. You're funny enough. You're good enough. All those things. Yes, you are. And guess what? All the trials and all the tribulations you've been through have made you strong to be the person that you are today. Let's share it with the world. Be the best version of you. Live to your optimal self. All right? There you go. That's today's Optimal Self Live. Again, please jump over to OptimalSelf.today. Share, like, comment. This is, how, this is how we grow this community. And again, the community is what makes this. You guys supporting one another is what makes it great. So without you, we don't have anything. So... Thank you so much for joining me and I will see you tomorrow.